the time Red Skull killed Captain America. We start 50 years ago, where all the villains came together to defeat and kill all the heroes in one final battle. And here we see Captain America, laying in the rubble of the once great Capitol building, barely being able to move, let alone breathe, as he is on the brink of death. As he whispers a prayer to God, wishing for this all to be over. And here we see Red Skull, mocking one of Earth's mightiest heroes, telling him, God is not on your side. Today, it is just me. And he begins to mock the great captain. Why didn't we think of this years ago? I knew for a fact you couldn't have beaten us if I got all of us organized. And Captain, do you know what happens next? We're going to carve up your beloved country into three regions for all of our lieutenants. The Abomination wants California. Doom wants the Bible Belts. And for some godforsaken reason, Magneto wants Las Vegas. And who do you think will get the White House? And we see Captain America begin to cry, knowing that he can't do anything to stop this madness. Red Skull with a sick and twisted grin tells him, don't get upset. It will all be over soon, grabbing Captain America by the head and crushing his skull. 50 years later, we now see the White House, now known as New Babylon. And we see Red Skull now in a trophy room as we see Iron Man's armor, Spider-Man's mask, Thor's helmet, Silver Surfer's surfboard, and worst of all, Captain America's shield, along with countless other heroes' trophies. And as we see Red Skull, we see him wearing his favorite trophy of all, Captain America's mask, with Steve Rogers' blood still staining the costume. As Red Skull says, even now, after all these years, I'd beat you. Even as an old man, I am still strong. Make sure to like, subscribe, and check out my other videos. But with anime, and that will be in the link in the description down below. And I will see you guys in the next video.